do what you're told and you pay attention in many places grown-ups if you the child does that but if you see a child focused on their work in front of them and not fidgeting and not looking around and not wriggling you often a teacher a teacher or an educator will think oh yeah they're engaged and probably what they really mean or what a psychologist would see is focus which is important it's not unimportant and compliance being able to follow rules. Again, not unimportant, but not the most important thing, because actually if you flip this around and help a child get really engaged, which is to be absorbed by something, to lose awareness of what's going on around you because you're so focused on the task, to have an internal sense or drive to learn more or achieve more with the project, whatever it is, then oftentimes children are focused, they do pay attention, and they're able to acknowledge or, you know, abide by rules. So engagement comes first, not after. And if you, and and like I said, developmental psychologists know this. I mean, watch any three-year-old who's wriggling around and looking around and shouting out or doing what three-year-olds do, and then watch them get really absorbed in something they care about, building something with blocks or rolling a ball or watching something fascinating that's going on outside the car window they become totally absorbed and totally engaged. And that's what you want. So the thing that educators often forget is that what the school should do is build on natural development, not try to redirect it or thwart it. And that's what I'm arguing for in the book. So so to go back to the question of curiosity or creativity and why those are important early on or well-being, it's because... Fostering those is the best foundation for the kinds of learning that are important later on. I mean, learning about mathematics or learning how to read a complex text or learning how to write software for a computer. It's not that those things are unimportant. It's just a question of what's the best way to get people able to do those things.